Welcome everyone. Dr. Mandel here with you. I'm hoping that everyone out there is having a wonderful day or night, depending upon where you are worldwide. I hope that you will enjoy this topic. Well, the big question is, which drug will not help inflammation and swelling? I will come back to that answer right after this. These medications are everywhere throughout the world. People taking it for pain, inflammation, cramps, fever, the list can go on and on. Although in a nutshell, let's tell you the difference between these medications. I need to state to everyone that I'm not here to push these medications nor knock them in any way. I just want to give you the facts. There are millions of people worldwide who are using these medications incorrectly. So let's look at these two medications together, Advil and Motrin. They both contain ibuprofen. Ibuprofen is designed to reduce inflammation and take away pain. So here's a leave. A leave contains naproxen. Again, it's used to relieve pain as well as inflammation. So a leave, Advil, and Motrin are non-steroidal anti-inflammatories. They're designed to reduce inflammation and pain. They're primarily used for headaches, tendinitis, swelling, arthritis, bursitis, and even gout attacks. So if you're suffering from inflammation of a joint, a pinched nerve, or swelling within the body, then these medications are designed to have that anti-inflammatory effect. Although I must say that non-steroidal anti-inflammatories can cause gastrointestinal problems. You want to take these medications when you have food in your stomach. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatories can affect the kidney. So if you're having kidney problems, please speak with your physician. So last but not least is the old Tylenol. Tylenol is acetaminophen. Acetaminophen works along with pain and not inflammation. So the many people worldwide taking this for inflammation, you might want to think twice before you take it next time. Unfortunately, acetaminophen has been known to cause serious effects with the liver. So if you are having any kind of liver issues, please follow up with your physician. There are many over-the-counter medications that already contain acetaminophen, Actifed, Excedrin, Midol, Robitussin, Sudafed, Vix, and many others. I want to mention that all four of these medications will reduce fever. So if you said number two, yes, you are the winner. I want to thank you for tuning into this video. I hope that this information will give you a better direction about your health and well-being. I ask you to share this video on your social media so we can help educate others worldwide. Leave your comments below because there will be many. And most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.